thank you. He has been referred to as the heart of Corktown. Tonight, the community remembers Greg Mudge, a businessman who wanted to make an impact and chose Corktown as his home. Greg Mudge, the owner of Mudge's Deli, died unexpectedly over the weekend at the age of 46. Mudge was an early investor in Corktown, going from a restaurant employee to owner to leader. Tonight, our Kim DiGiulio takes a look back at the life of a man who really made his mark on the community. Greg Mudge opened Mudgy's Deli and Wine Shop in Corktown in 2008, well before a lot of development started happening in this area. But Greg saw the potential of this community and he wanted to be a part of it. And he was. That is until his life was cut short unexpectedly as he died Sunday morning in his home. The Corktown community stunned to hear the news that Greg Mudge, owner of Mudgy's Deli and Wine Shop, passed away unexpectedly. He was just a fixture at Corktown. I felt like he was going to be here forever. Greg fell in love with this location while working as a server at F. McNally's, what this place used to be before Mudgy's. It was F. McNally's and then they were going to close this location and he was like, I'm going to, I'm going to do it. So he opened up a small deli that served up big sandwiches. I remember when this was just a tiny little store on the front of the building and it just grew and grew and grew and it became this paradise. It became this vision for what he had uh, and the patio and everything. Today, Mudgies is a staple in Corktown and that's because of the owner that Greg was. He had a personality that filled every space in this restaurant. Um, he would come in and in the morning, he, you know, everyone's kind of quiet and tired. It's early and he'd walk in and just with the loudest good morning, just kind of wake everyone up. Even those that would visit Mudgies knew that Greg had a special way of connecting with people. He's just sitting in there like making soup and hey, hey, hey try this, give this a shot. You know, tr try this out. Oh, he's got this new bottle and it's wonderful. I didn't know anything about wine, but he put something in front of you and it'd be delicious. He just had an innate sense for what was good and what felt good to, to enjoy as a person. I spoke with Greg's mom on the phone earlier this morning. She said she was too devastated to go on camera, but she says she and the family are still waiting on information on the cause of Greg's death. In Corktown, I'm Kim DiGiulio, Local 4.